there could be an idea that the way that I make my circuits on well varnished wood, triplex, multiplex, with brass nails, uh, is not a very efficient way to make an electronic circuit. And also it is not possible, could be an idea, that um, miniature circuits cannot be made, made in that way. I want to show the contrary in this video. This is a miniature circuit that I've made. It belongs to my uh, kitchen timer circuit that I want to publish. Still thinking about it whether I will use uh, field effect transistors in the first stage or not. Anyway, it's a very uh, made on a piece of plywood, three millimeters, well varnished. And here is the back side. And you can see that I've used a, a tiny amount of pin pens, push pins, sorry, and brass nails. So it's possible to make such a circuit with so many uh, transistors in a very uh, small way, Pro approximately say six and a half centimeters at four centimeters. And the circuit of that audio beeper is here. I've published another circuit a few days ago, tested it again, and found that it didn't work. But this circuit works surely, made with a few uh, small signal transistors. And what I uh, discovered is that the first transistor didn't have the proper bias. So the relation between this resistor and that resistor. So I mounted here a 10k resistor to make it work. And also here a 1k resistor in the collector lead. Anyway, it's a classical A stable multivibrator circuit. And the output of that multivibrator goes to this uh, complementary end stage made with two small signal transistors, the BC557 and the BC547, PMP and PN. Very easy circuit, can be made in a neat and a proper way on a very small piece of wood, well varnished wood. It all belongs to the, the timer circuit, the kitchen timer circuit. Here is the first setup for that kitchen timer. I want to demonstrate it because my camera battery is almost dead. It works. And I wish you luck.